Hello everyone, here we are with God of War Ragnarok Part 21. I hope you enjoy your stay. So, here it is. The spark of the world. This is... beautiful. I'll meet you across. This feels too easy. Odin knows we have Gellhorn. He knows you have the mask. After killing Brock, he knows we would seek Surtur to start this war. But what other choice do we have? None. He knows that, too. This is it. What about Sinmara? Should we at least tell her? No. It had hurt her too much. More than not knowing what happened to you? Sometimes... ...loving someone is about... ...choosing... ...the lesser pain. That doesn't make any sense. Promise. You'll stay away from her. You have our word. Sorter, is stabbing you with the blades gonna be enough to create this new you? Sinmara's heart is cold. So beautifully cold. Your dad's now got my fire in those blades. If enough of me and the sparks fire go into enough of her, it should work. Okay. Come here. This'll hurt. gonna take. Now attack! 
Great! Hear that? All we have to do is call him with Gallarhorn when we're ready. Let's head back to Moose Barn. We can take the Mystic Gateway back from there. It worked. I can't believe it. We've got Ragnarok on our side. Sorter's plan just... worked. I mean, the Valkyries were a small setback, but I bet we've got Odin worried now. He knows we're coming for him. <laughs> Think about it. We're gonna show up to Asgard, and Ragnarok's gonna come in and wreck everything. Odin won't stand a chance. We're gonna win. Groa was right. Groa failed to predict what we would sacrifice in return. Maybe she could only see the big stuff. This is gonna work, right? It must. Ragnarok's strength grows. Hey, check out that cliff. The earthquake must have shook this place up enough to make a ledge. More of Odin's forces. Up this way, Father. We can climb back towards the gate. So, you fought in a lot of wars, right? You've never had anything like Ragnarok on your side? I have. And the creature does not guarantee our victory. Right. place is gonna fall apart if those keep happening.
Father, the Ainher Yar aren't gonna stop attacking anytime soon. We need to get back. Be quiet. I mean, you're always quiet, but this feels different. I had hoped my days of ceaseless battles were over. I had hoped to never see my son go to war. we're doing the right thing. Ragnarok has to happen. The price we and others paid for this war is high. It'll only get higher. It'll be worth it. to a certain Vanium Numpty did run out. Ragnarok awaits our call. As do the armies of hell. Thanks mostly to me. It seems war is upon us at last. Where to now, brother? We've some time before we're expected at the temple. This could be our last chance, father. Is there anything you want to finish up? Only that it was the great passion of Odin's life. He journeyed across Adir's burning ocean into the heart of the silent matron herself to find it. Lost every man in his crew, but to hear him tell it, it was worth all that blood and more. a feeling you might pop in here. You know everybody's meeting made guard. Right? Appreciate it. Time to cleave some heads. Now those are some
some angry knives. Ought to make Odin's spear look like a toothpick. Let's make some magic. Hey, y'all, uh, I just wanted you to know if you need anything at all, I'll be around. Either here or at Brock and Dittry's old shop. Yeah, I know we're all busted up inside today, but, you know, I for one like to keep busy. This is it then, the beginning of the end. The end for Odin, and after that, a new beginning for the rest of us. Atreus. I know, I'm just looking forward to seeing all the realms finally standing up to him. Elves and dwarves and hell itself. You are so certain they will unite? They have to, after everything they've been through. They have to, don't they? Anything in Midgard you want to do? You know, while we still can. Freya and the others are still making preparations for the attack, so there's time. Ready when you are. The armies are probably gathered in their home realms, waiting for when we blow Gallarhorn. Guess I was kind of hoping to see some of them here. When all the realm towers open at once, we'll see plenty, lad. Odin won't believe what's coming for him. No. Odin had lifetimes to prepare for this. Whatever grows deception, he heard the truth as tear. Do not underestimate him. Rousing speech, brother. Very inspirational. Wow. The Valkyries look different. Welcome back. Hildesfini informed me of your success. We've been planning accordingly. Well, what would Ragnarok be without Ragnarok? Who else agreed to join us? I see the Valkyries. Better than that, they are reborn. Corporeal and uncorrupted, thanks to no small amount of Vanir magic. They're shield maidens now. Nice. And your brother? He came through. The elves called a truce to unite against Asgard. That gives us an advantage by air, and with Hell's army for a vanguard. What about Sindri? Will the dwarves fight? We haven't heard from him. But there's time yet. And I think we have what we need to clear a path for the Ragnarok beast. Well, when you say it like that, why worry at all? Sigrun! It's good to see you, sword. Alive. Oh, yes. I wasn't myself when last we met. I'm glad you're safe. My queen, the shield maidens will be divided among the forces breaching from Alfheim, Helheim, and here in Midgard. We stand ready. Kratos, Atreus, Mimir, please excuse me. Oh. Good night, then. Freya. Have you determined our path out of Asgard? If the towers are the way in, we count on them being the way out. And if they are not? Then we all know what we signed up for. Our plan is only missing one thing. A leader. That honor is yours. You have a righteous claim. And the respect of your troops. And you have faced this enemy before. I held his invading army to a stalemate. 
This is our invasion, a siege on his terrain. I want our most experienced wartime general in the field. I don't care about the honors, I don't care about the prophecies and champions. I just need us to win. Freya. I know what I'm asking. Just... sleep on it? Here we are. Kratos, your tent is to the right, and Atreus, yours is to the left. Mine? A young warrior needs his own space, don't you think? I do. Wow. Thanks. Sleep on what we spoke of. Let me know in the morning what you decide. Excuse me. May I have a moment with Mimir? I don't know what tomorrow brings, but if tonight is our last night, I'd like to spend it feeling something besides hate. Will you tell me one last silly story? There's nothing I'd like more. Except perhaps a dance. Yet do I may have lost a step. <laughs> do you respect love? I don't tell silly stories. You only tell silly stories. <laughs> I could never argue with you. Can I sleep here tonight? quiet your mind. I can't. Then I will tell you a story. If I fall asleep, promise you'll finish it tomorrow?
Dave's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of humor. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from the taste in men, of course. She was a special woman. She wanted to protect people. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us. Leading us home. Does my request upset you? F is a natural part of life, my love. I wish only to be prepared for when my time comes. Mortals must do such things. I am glad to have you prepare with me. You are quiet. I have nothing to say. Well. Say something. I enjoy hearing your voice. The funeral pyre. I would have chosen different. Oh? Mm. In my land, we entomb our loved ones. You would have me trapped in the ground for eternity. I would have you close to me. How touching. My rotting corpse would bring you such comfort. <laughs> you once tried to take charge of your ending, did you know? That was different. Circumstance, yes, but not on purpose. Mm. You prepare for a distant future. There is much time ahead of us. I wish to better a future that will exist without me, whenever that day comes, for you and for our son. <sighs> we will always walk together, Kratos. You will always be a part of me. I will always be a part of you. When you are gone, that part of me dies as well. See? You feel your absence. No. Culmination of love is grief. And yet we love, despite the inevitable. We open our hearts. When the pyre is spent, and you have gathered my ashes, spread them from the highest peak in all the realms. You will do this for me. is to have loved fully. Open your heart to 
to the world as you have opened it to me, and you will find every reason to keep living in it. What's going on? It is time. I'll meet you outside, Father. Sir. one more time, my queen. Me too. But not as your queen. As sisters. Are you ready? Yes. I will be your general. It will be an honor to fight alongside you, general. Aye, brother. I'll be right by your side. So, what are your orders? To the temple. General. Sir? General? General? Sir. Hey, bud. Uh, General. Prophecy did not lead us here, nor will it win this battle. Wars are won by those that are willing to sacrifice everything. If that is the cost of vengeance, so be it. Odin has taken so much from us already. The realms have suffered. Enough! No matter the cost. This ends... today. But going out in a blaze of glory means that Odin burns too? 
That's where I'll be. A big fat smile on my face. For Brock. Yourselves. after Niflheim next. They're trying to shut out Ragnarok. You've got to stop those war machines. Not an ideal start. Wait. Ingrid, we don't have time. I know. work to do. You three, follow them. Treyas. Freya, with me. Watch our flanks. To the war machines. This way! Strike the city with our allies. Sounds desperate. Good. Desperation is our advantage. We're the prepared our own destroying fire giants, but I suppose desperation is better than nothing. <laughs>
Was that? It was. Odin's new Valkyrie queen is the knock. This complicates things. I would think so. Then we must hurry. They sound eager. Good. Giant Giants made it after all. The snake looks different. He is different. But when I was away, uh, uh, never mind, later. The Ain Herjars link to Valhalla. My sisters and I must sever it. Go. Still no sign of the dwarves. Sindri won't let us down. We have to trust him. Hmm. Rally all you can. We will make for this fall of Huntawa. Delightful. 
I know, I'm late. Where is your army? No more dwarves are dying for this. Save it! Odin forced them to build those war machines. And I'm here to tear them down. Before you break them, we must turn them on the floor. Fine. Leave it to the dwarves to clean up after the child. what you wanted I, I didn't want this no close your heart to it close your heart who are they my guardians Odin took them in they shouldn't be here they're not soldiers Odin put them in our path to die. It's war. Wars are won. By those who are willing to sacrifice... ...everything. What are you doing? that never, not for anyone. I was wrong, Atreus. I was wrong. Open your heart. Open your heart to their suffering. That is your mother's wish. And mine as well. Today, so. better but what can we do you see the size of that thing I think we're gonna win I mean if they don't kill us first why have you stopped Ragnarok is here we finally have Odin right where we we will stop Odin but we did not come to sacrifice the innocent. We will breach the wall at Hrimthor's flaw. With what army? Atreus and I will be enough. That's suicide. It may be. But we will die seeking justice, not vengeance. Can that weapon break open the flaw? Only one way to find out. You three. Get those people to safety wherever you can find it. We will see it done. Frey and I will do what we can to slow Ragnarok. He was not mindless before. See if he will listen to reason. <laughs> Odin will not get away. If he does. Those that are trapped. And meet you at the wall. Go! 
Go, Atreus! That would be the end of part 21 of God of War Ragnarok. Thank you for watching and for your support. Please make sure to like, comment and subscribe if you enjoy the content. Love you all. Take care guys.